What's good? It's your boy Young Black back again. Um, I just did a little afterthought review for um, Dragon Age because I beat the game. I'm gonna do another quick video. Uh, hopefully, it should be quick. Everybody says that, and they, you look down, it's been on for nine minutes. Uh, big anime fan. Not super big. I'm, I'm, but I am kind of an otaku, though. I do love my anime. Classic anime. I'm more of a old school, you know, Fist of the North Star, Dragon Ball Z. The old school action cartoon scene was really me. But I like a lot of other stuff, too. I like Escaflone. I don't know if everybody's seen the movie Origins. And Naruto. I like Naruto, which is pretty new. Which is like, everybody's calling Naruto the new Dragon Ball Z for, for the last two or three years. Naruto been a new DBZ since DBZ's died down and everybody else seen everything you could possibly see from it. Um, but I want to talk about Naruto, Ultimate Ninja Storm. All right, this is a really good game. I don't care what anybody says. All right, out of all the Naruto games I've played, this is the best one. The only game that even comes close to this is those 2D PS2 games. But the only thing that makes this game 110 times more better than those is the graphics. And that the fighting is actually 3D, and it's in a third dimensional arenas, which means you could actually dodge left and right instead of just up and down or jumping back and forth into the background and substituting left and right like you do in um, the PS2 Naruto games, which are very popular too. Um, this game doesn't have as many characters as the, um, the PS2 games. PS2 games have a lot of um, characters that people are really fan favorites of and are really super happy to play with, like some of the Hokages, um, and the fourth Hokage, which they call them, I think, Yellow Flash? Yeah, they call them Yellow Flash. But that's really the fourth Hokage, who's actually, I, I believe, is Naruto, that's Naruto's father. But they don't, I don't think, I'm not sure, I never heard that, but I mean, he looks just like Naruto, just tall and older. And they call him the fourth Hokage, so one plus one is two. I'm figuring that's probably Naruto's father, nine times out of ten. But um, the game, this game is really good. I mean, it's only for PlayStation 3. And if you want to see what your PS3 can do, power-wise, or what these companies can do when they put some time into it and they're really passionate, this game, it looks, the people say it looks just like the cartoon, but you see how the box looks? That's almost exactly how the game looks when you're playing. And that's, that's art, that's cartoon, but the game looks almost exactly like that while you're playing, you know? The backgrounds, the, the 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 aura that comes off of you from the chakra, everything is perfect. This game is 90 times better than that DBZ game that just came out. Um, what is it called? Raging Blast or whatever. I'll probably get it, but I'm going to wait until it's like 40 bucks because it's going to drop within two months, three months. That game is going to get cheaper quick. Then people aren't going to buy it. They're getting tired of playing Dragon Ball Z games that are basically the same game, but they just did um, Tenkaichi with less characters and more graphics in a bigger arena, fighting arena, which is cool, but I mean, come on, I'm not gonna pay $60 for that, not right now. Even if I had the extra $60, I wouldn't I wouldn't buy it. To me, it's just not worth it. It's just a, a recop of something I had before. They, and they changed the controllers. They, can, they changed the button configuration. So not only is it something you played already, you gotta get your ass whooped a whole bunch of times and relearn the controllers on some shit that you know you've done played a hundred times already. Right? On an older system now. Right. Now Naruto is kind of like that too, but at the same time, the things that are innovative about this game are really innovative. I mean, the graphics are through the roof. It, it, the, the PS2 game is like 1920, and this is like the Jetsons compared to that, PS, that PS2 game, those PS2 Naruto games, you know? I was just amazed. It's the closest thing I've ever seen to the to the cartoon or the closest video game I've ever seen where they try to simulate something on that's a video or a movie or a cartoon. They simulate and they're trying to transfer it on to, into game form. This is the closest I've ever, ever, ever seen. I mean, the combat is very innovative. I like how you can use um, ninja items in battle like you can do in the, um, the PS2 Ultimate Ninja. You can use ninja items too, but... It just looks a lot better in this, you know. Um, the ultimate jitsus are still the same. Either you twirl a controller or you press the buttons and then do hand signs, which is which is really fun. I mean, for some people, it feels like they, like you have a, an, an advantage if you put the buttons in 
and they gotta press you got to press the buttons because a lot of people do not know where the, the the buttons are on these controllers. You'd be surprised. People be playing PlayStation 3 or PlayStation 2 for years, and they still don't have these buttons memorized. <coughs> so you can win matches surely just on that. Right? Okay. Now, um, one gripe. No online. There's no online for this game at all. Why, I don't know. And, and it's not coming. It's not going to be another version of the game with an online. Nothing. Just no online totally at all. So if you're playing somebody, you're going to have to be sitting on your couch or you're playing a computer all day. Which, once you play the game, you're not even going to mind it because it's so innovative and, and so fun that you really don't care that you're not really playing online. And to be honest with you, I don't play so, too many games online anyway because people do a lot of cheap shit in these games nowadays because they act like they're getting a check for a fight and it's just for fun. You know, and people don't play for fun. They do a lot of cheap shit just to get victories and it gets a little aggravating. You don't want to get aggravated. You're playing, we're playing games to have fun. You know? Um, what else about the game? They don't make it anymore, I heard. This game, you can't go into a store and just find this game. And if you do just go into a store and just find it, you better buy it. Because Walmart or Target, they're not getting these games in new. GameStop, the guy at GameStop told me they don't make this game new anymore. And I got like a, a brand new copy the other day. It was just sitting there. And I had this game before, but I traded it in. Well, actually, it was stolen from me when I was um, locked up. It was stolen, and I couldn't find it when I got out. But went in there a day ago, and there was two copies of this just sitting there that somebody traded in, or two people traded in a copy apiece. And I said, I have to have it. I said, I've been looking for this game for a minute. And I told my wife to buy it for me when I wasn't home, and she ended up buying two copies of Dragon Ball Z for some reason, which means, I don't know, she got confused and bought two copies of the same game. But this is what I wanted, and she couldn't find it. And I found it used, and it uses like brand spanking new. You know, so I got lucky on that. So if you see this game, and you know you're a little bit of a Naruto fan, or if you just want to see what your, your PlayStation 3 is, is capable of, pick this game up, I'm telling you. And it's not even that expensive. I think brand new, if you can find it in Target or something like that, if they have one sitting on the shelf, probably 40 bucks. GameStop, if you find it. Probably twenty nine ninety nine to thirty four ninety nine for a game that's is actually worth paying sixty dollars for, not for replay value, but just for sheer combat value is what I call it. If it's fun to play with the different characters in the game space that the that um Cyber Connect Two, which is a company that actually puts the game together, the graphics and fighting and everything, the game space that they provide you with is very very fun. I mean, it's very very fun. You see Naruto, you seen Naruto use. The um the nine tail fox and the um ultimate ninja for um PlayStation, but in this game is totally different. To see the fire radiating off of him, you see his eyes widen like a fox and everything. You see all that, and he changes stance, and you actually see the 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 chakra aura that radiates around him while he's the fox. It actually is shaped like a fox, like it's a fox silhouette of fire around him. So. Come on, I mean, it just looks incredible. And the Jitsus look incredible. It looks just like the television show. So if anybody is going to go look for games, look for this game if you're at all an anime fan. All right? Or if you're just a fighting game fan, you're looking for something new to play. Not a complex fighting system, but still very fun once you get it down pat. All right? I'm trying to put you guys on, man. It's your boy, Young Black. Real gamers, stand up.